Gigi Guerrero Carse, and I'm the host of The Big Shift. How did this show got conceived? So just to let you know, it was um, my idea actually, because <laughs> I thought that it's time to have a show, a TV show, that will talk about life of immigrants in Canada. We needed something to show to the world uh, what real life is, so that's why uh, it was uh, me and Ray Fortaleza, who's the owner of Ray Fort Media Group, who got together but, you know, uh, uh, talked about what uh, show would be best uh, to highlight about uh, life of immigrants. So that's how uh, it all started, the big shift, and now it has come to this, where we have a band, uh, we have our, uh, the people behind the, the scenes who will be helping us to really have a really great show for everyone. So I'm, I, I hope that everyone would have, um, you know, a wonderful time getting to know about us being immigrants, how our life is here. Well, about um, the most amazing or the most memorable experience I had when I first arrived in Canada was the, um, the beauty of Canada. I think um, one thing that really I can't get out of my mind is when it's autumn, fall, yeah, we call it here in Canada, autumn, uh, where the, the leaves in the trees would turn into purple, brown, red, um, uh, orange, and if you could just see the beauty, it's something that, um, that will stay in your memory uh, for a lifetime. Uh, it's a turn of seasons, and not only autumn, autumn of course, but of course uh, the winter, spring, and summer. But I think for me, the, my favorite would be autumn because of the, the colors that uh, we see all around us, uh, along the streets, when we walk, in the parks, the color of the leaves, and, uh, and um, the beauty of nature. So that's one thing that I love about Canada. And what can I say about the thing that I had a hard time with would be the loneliness, being homesick. Uh, that was one thing that I had a few, you know, uh, struggled with during the first few years. Missing my family, missing my relatives. Although I, I came here in Canada in 2005 uh, with my husband and with my two children, but nothing can compare home. I was born in the Philippines and I miss my relatives there. I miss my, my parents, I miss my uh, cousins, uh, my uh, grandparents. So, so that's one thing that I missed. It was kind of hard at first, but I just had to focus on, on my new life in Canada. I just had to have that um, determination to, to you know, pull myself through. And right now I'm here, I've been here for almost nine years and so far it's been good and now I have this show and I want to share this show The Big Shift to all of you. So thank you and see you.